Good afternoon, wonderful women and men that love wonderful women and friends. Uh, I am Nikki Tanner, and I'm here with Susan Schlechter. And uh, fellow board member Ann Kirshner, we together serve as uh, co-chairs of this lunch. And Ann, as you heard, is not with us because she's in Arizona being a troublemaker and talking about her newest book, which has an unlikely title, Lady in the OK Corral. And the book tells the story of Josephine Marcus Earp. Yes, Wyatt Earp's common law wife for over 50 years. Who knew, right? But there is uh, Wyatt Earp, and he is buried in a Jewish cemetery right next to his beloved Josephine. And in her wonderful book, Anne brings us Josephine's story, and in so doing, adds a whole dimension to the history of the American West. And in true Jewish women's archive fashion, Anne's book shows us how the fuller, more complete story of men and women enriches all of us and makes the world much more interesting. So Anne, with the rest of us uh, JWA Nicks, believe that to be labeled troublemaker is a high compliment indeed. And that's why we have come together today to honor three extraordinary women who serve as examples of our collective troublemaking potential. And we're pretty sure, well, we certainly hope, that their stories today will inspire you to cultivate your own troublemaking abilities. Good afternoon. I'm Susan Levin Schlechter. As I got dressed to come here this morning, I purposely put on this locket. It was my grandmother's and my mother's, and uh, now it's mine. And so I'm standing here on the shoulders of some wonderful and brave women, as I know you are. And I like to take things that belong to my mother and grandmother with me, as if they're coming along with me to certain events that I know they would enjoy being at. I'm thrilled to introduce a brave and strong woman who is a troublemaker on a daily, if not hourly, basis. <laughs> Letty Cotton Pogrebin, one of last year's honorees, is a journalist, a nationally known lecturer, a founding editor of Ms. Magazine, a social, social justice activist, and an author of countless essays and books from how to tolerate, no, Letty wouldn't like that word, uh, how to get over getting older, and books on Jewish feminism. Her 10th book, How to Be a Friend to a Friend Who's Sick, will be published, I believe, this week, and we have flyers in all of your books, so you can pre-order just as I did. <laughs> there is no one more appropriate to be an MC for our program today. Letty, 